How's it going, boys? We're back. And before we get started, subscribe, like, share. Definitely subscribe. Definitely like. Definitely share. Like I tell you guys, I'm going to keep on telling you guys. I talk about a lot of cool shit, so you know, hover my numbers up. And today, boys, we're going to be talking about Ditto and the Pillowway card. And the new upcoming set, Pokemon Go, coming in July. I forgot what date, but it's coming in July. Somewhere in the middle. I'm not sure. I'll put the date right here if I remember, but I might not. Who knows? But anyways, and I have seen a couple of my, you know, tuber homies and their takes, and they are reaching really, really, really far. Um, and for me, it's such like an easy little, you know, idea. I don't know why it got where it's getting out of hand. So let me go give you guys my opinion of what I think this card is going to be and how it's going to be delivered. As of recording this video, the only information we have is that there's a pillowy card and they showed it all on a Bidoof. And that's the only information we have right now. So everything other than that is 100% speculation. But I'm going to give you guys my, you know, speculation, my opinion. Because um, I think, you know, I'm going to be a little bit more, you know, subtle with it. I'm not going to go ham. But I am going to give you guys some examples. You feel me? So right off the gate. This is a, this is an awesome idea. Um, I think Pokemon should have been done this idea. You know, I think they should have incorporated this with prior sets. I think it's pretty cool to be completely honest with you guys. And it kind of follows along to the whole you know Pokemon Go situation because if you guys remember, for the longest you could only catch certain Pokemon on Pokemon Go that would be able to transform into a Ditto. Um, so this kind of you know makes sense. But as soon as I say that, think about this. I'm pretty sure the way it's printed is there's going to be a sheet that has, you know, the stickers on, of course. And that sheet, the stickers that they put on there are all going to be more or less the same. And I'm not saying there's going to be more than Bidoof because I can't predict that. It might only be Bidoof. We don't know yet. But a big part of me says... That it's only going to be common cards. It's going to, be, going to be common cards that you can, you know, it's not going to be a big deal to, you know, take off. And the reason being is that common cards don't have any texture on them. They don't have any hollow. So it won't be a holographic, um, what's it called? Ditto in the bottom with a layer, a sticker layer of a holographic or textured, you know, radiant card or textured, you know, V card or V star at that. So that whole speculation that there could be a Radiant Charizard on top of and it'd be a sticker, 100% out the window. Um, I'm thinking Pokemon, the way they're going to print it is, of course, you know, they're going to try to be cheap. The sticker on top of it isn't necessarily going to be like a high quality, you know, it is going to be like the best sticker available, but it's not going to be super textured, you know, anything crazy. It's going to be the, a basic sticker over it. And it is going to be on top of, of a hollow card as far as I can see right now. So, that whole Charizard, Radiant Charizard, throw it out the window. The whole VSR thing, throw that out the window too. Even though, to be completely honest, if I'm feeding that theory, that Radiant Charizard on top of like the Ditto, with like the little two Ditto marker, is only going to make that Charizard way more valuable. Because think about this, hear me out. They're going to print out a shit ton of Radiance, right? Because right now, the TCG wants you to play, play Radiant cards. There's, there's going to be a whole bunch of them. I don't know if you guys have seen a lot of Radiant. Um, what's it called? Am I tripping right now? What's the word called? The new set. You guys know what I'm talking about. Astro Radiance. Um, I'm, I'm not sure if you guys have seen many openings, but a lot of people are pulling Radiance like left and right. I'm saying the pull rates on those are amazing, which is a good thing because a lot of them are really, really playable. And TCG wants people to play them. So that's reason you know, they're into them as much as they can. So this Charizard, I'm not going to say is it going to be an easy chase. I still don't know that information yet. But they're going to be probably, let's say, let's just put small numbers. There's going to be 10 Radiant Charizards. So the hypothetical, because like I said, it's not going to happen. Hypothetical Radiant Sticker Charizard over a Ditto. So you feel me? If we're thinking about it that way, essentially, if they do do that, that would be a bigger chase. It would not be a bad thing. And right now, like the, the narrative that that's going to be a bad thing for Pokemon and all this and all that doesn't make sense at all. But going back to it, I don't believe that that's what's going to happen. I think it is going to be just straight common cards that nobody would care to, you know, rip off. Um, 
long term, what I think this means and what I think this is a good idea is because they could use this idea for something else. All right. Hear me out. Hear me out. You guys, you know, you guys follow Rudy. You guys like Rudy. You know what I'm saying? Rudy's awesome from Alpha Investments. He always talks about, you know, the pillowy cards. And all I'm thinking right now is that eventually, eventually, it would be cool to see if they had, let's say, Charizard. I mean, we're, we're right here talking about Charizard. Let's say there's a Charizard card, right? And the only way to know that you pull the Charizard card is if you get a pillowy card, but... To find out if there's a charger under there, you have to peel it off. So there's, you know, two levels of lotteriness, of riskiness. One is the chance of pulling a pillowy card, right? You guys follow me? And then two, the chance of it actually being a Charizard. And why if it's like, you know, 10 different cards that you possibly could pull. And of course, everyone wants to pull the Charizard or the Pikachu out of that pillowy. And then all the pillowy cards are dittos. Let's just call them dittos. And let's continue the theory. There's going to be a ditto card. And the pillow weight is going to be... Um, if you guys remember back in Delta Species, um, ditto had like a whole bunch of variants. Like the... Um, what's it called? Charmander form, Pikachu form, um, Bulbasaur form. Why if they did something like that? And, but you peeled away the ditto card and it was one of them. Hypothetically, this opens up that door. Do you guys feel me? For that to actually be a thing. For us to get a pillowy card that actually in the bottom of that pillowy card is the chase. So like I said, this is an awesome idea. I honestly do think they're only going to do this over common cards. And honestly, if they did it over a uh, chase, it would only make that chase card and the sticker on top of it even more, you know, fruitful. If that makes any sense. So that is 100% my take on this, you know, pillowy thing. Honestly, I'm excited for it. I am going to keep a couple sealed because uno nunca sabe, you know what I'm saying? This is going to be one of those small little niche cards that if they don't replicate it in other sets, it's going to be a one of. And of course, they could end up being a dollar. Who fucking knows? But they could not. So who knows? You know what I'm saying? And also, we don't know the chase. We don't know. We don't know the pull rates on that. We don't know any of that. You know what I'm saying? So right now, like I said, it's 100%. My speculation, but I'm going at it with my knowledge that I have of, you know, the Pokemon game. And just, I mean, I'm not sure about whole, the whole printing situation, but I'm pretty sure printing a sticker over a hollow. Imagine how much that's going to weigh. That's going to, you know, cause other issues. So, I don't know. You have to take so much into consideration. Um, me personally, that's just how I feel. But let's see if I can pull something decent. Um, I just saw some, I thought it was, it looks like a... A double bubble, but I mean, not a double bubble, but a reverse, a nice reverse hit. But honestly, it probably just looks like some heavy ass, um, hollow bleed. I bet. Hey, man, more a reverse rare. So let's see. Um, psh, ain't that but a bitch. Trilogy. But hey, reverse rare. That works out. But with all that being said, comment down below. Tell me how you guys feel about this. Tell me if I'm tripping. Um, and you know, shit. Let me know how, what you guys think. Either way. We gone.